okay, here's the problem. You found this awesome mix online by some DJ. It's like an hour long. You're halfway through it and you want to know what track is playing. So you check the track list, but there are no timestamps. So it's actually pretty hard to figure out which of these songs is playing right now. But for the DJ, it's actually also pretty tedious and time consuming to create a timestamped track list. So I made this website that makes it really easy for DJs to do this. You basically just upload an Ableton or FL Studio project file that has timeline markers, and then it converts those into a track list. Here's a mix I made that I imported into Ableton and added timeline markers throughout the whole thing with the artist name and the track name. I can basically just upload this file, this project file to the website and click upload. And then it will generate the track lists and print it out for me. I can click this copy to clipboard button. And let's say I was going to SoundCloud, I can just directly paste it right into the description. So I made, so I actually made this mix directly in Ableton. And if you do that, you, you don't need to export it and then import it. You can just upload the original project file, um, including tempo automations if it has it. Um, this whole thing works exactly the same way for FL Studio. Here's a mix I made in, or here's the same mix that I imported into FL and added the timeline markers. I can just go to the website and upload that FLP and it will do basically the same thing and print out the timestamps, which I can copy. This also works if you use Rekordbox. So if you record your mix directly in Rekordbox, you can find your recording of the mix, um, find that file on your computer, and then right next to it is a .q file. You can upload that .q file to the website, and then it will also generate timestamps based off of that file that Rekordbox generates. And then you can copy them in the same way. So that's pretty much it. If you're a DJ, it would be really great if you could try this out and let me know how it worked and let me know if you think it's useful. If you're not a DJ, um, but just like listening to mixes and want to see more timestamps, it would be great if you could help me share this with your favorite DJs and help get the word out. That's pretty much it. Thanks for watching.